All right, thanks, Frank. Now we check out those Royals of Bleckley County. They host veterans and look to avenge that 49-29 road, 49-21 road loss when these teams met last season. And here come those Royals. Looking mighty fine in that purple. Veterans first possession. They give it to Julian Barnes, who runs off into the sunset and loses the ball along the way. A little bright out there. Royals recover it, and it's Bleckley's ball. Third and 10 now. Royals from 30 yards out. Watch the strike from Dominic Sasser to Marcus Brown. Get out the way, ref. Marcus fights off the defense from Cameron Smith. Bleckley is on the board, 7-0. Veterans now on the 18-yard line. Give it to LeBron Fields. He's off like a rocket, but eventually brought down at the Royals 27. Still a very nice run after a 55-yard pickup. We'll take all of those yards. And from there, the Royals defense would get stingy. This pitch to Julian Barnes goes nowhere. Ty Williams for Bleckley County. First one on the scene for the tackle. Veterans would attempt a 42-yard field goal, but not quite. Daniel Gibbs' kick is no good. Still 7-0 Royals. Veterans driving again. This time, Blake Etheridge finds Nate Boehm past midfield for a 25-yard pickup. Nicely done. And a Warhawks first down. A few plays later from 17 yards out, they give it to LeBron Fields again, and he finds a way through the heart of the defense. In for the TD. We're tied 7-7. Nice job, Warhawks. Second quarter now. Royals' Dominic Sasser with a quick sideline strike to Marcus Brown for a first down. And they would end up going for a 22-yard field goal by Treg Corner. And that is good. Put your hands up, Mr. Referee. That puts the Royals back up 10-7. Zaxby's FFN scoreboard. Final score, Warhawks get the win 28-10.